Hey MB crew, I'm gonna be here. So we're back with another hair video. Before we get into this video, make sure you turn on your post notifications so you're notified whenever I post a new video on my channel. Make sure you subscribe to my lifestyle channel. It is life, well, my lifestyle slash vlogging channel. It's life as I'm gonna be. It will be linked in the description box below. So make sure you guys head over there and subscribe. Show your girl some love. Help her build her new channel. <laughs> and make sure you guys are following me on Instagram at Mona X Banks. Today we're going to be doing the trend that's been going around which is temporary hair color like the wax hair color and the hair color that I have right here is from glam wax underscore underscore I'll put them here on the screen if you're interested in purchasing they did gift these to me so shout out to them for sending these to me so I was like of course I got to share them with the MB crew and let them know how I feel about them and everything like that so it is temporary hair dye from glam wax underscore they have a array of colors like gold and silver and you know red and things like that so I chose purple and blue and so I'm just gonna like kind of mix them together like intertwine them and see what type of look we can do I am gonna be doing a twist out now my hair isn't dirty I did have my hair in two strand twists but I literally just took them out so what I'm gonna do is wet my hair and everything and we're gonna jump right in okay so that should be good enough I don't want to overdo it and have my hair be extremely extremely wet but yeah and my hair it doesn't have any product build up or anything because I only use one product in my hair to do the twist so it's not like nothing crazy you know you'll see my fro he's she's getting big it's just I don't know what's going on I feel like my hair ain't never grew this fast very strange this is how they come packaged both of them so this is the purple ones like i said i'm gonna intertwine them and this is just what it looks like after you wet hair take a small amount of mud in the palm of your hand circle of rubbing uniform try to get on finger and then gently pull the finger from your hair root to the bottom so it will smear evenly Hmm, it smells like men's cologne. This is what it looks like, the purple one. Hopefully it shows, and it does come with the seal, both of them did. And you get about 4.23 fluid ounces, so I feel like that's a decent amount. This one smells the same. So we have purple and blue. Okay, so it does feel like, it feels like a mousse. Kind of like grease, honestly. Like it is on the waxy side. It's really pigmented. It's smooth though. It's kind of like a mousse. Like chocolate mousse. That's what it's reminding me of. The texture. I'm going to be using a Luster's Pink Curling Twist Pudding. I've showed this on my channel when my hair was a bit longer. So if you want to see like a video on it, check that out. So, I'm going to take some of the Twist and Curl Cream. I mean Curl and Twist Pudding by Pink. Right, because I still want my hair to be moisturized. I'm going to go in with the color. Is this really going to show up? Oh, yeah. Do y'all see it? Hopefully, y'all can see this. And then I'm just going to twist my hair. Y'all think this is going to be all over my bonnet? Oh, my gosh. Y'all, th these gloves are not going to work. Oh, Lord. I'm going to just have to sacrifice my hands. Oh, well. Because I need to be able to make sure I'm in there real good. So, as y'all can see. And I'm just going to kind of go back and forth between using the blue and the purple. And I can use a small rat tail comb, y'all. Because my hair is um wet. Once I wet my hair down, it's not, and my hair is short. Like, I wouldn't recommend using a red tail comb if your hair was longer, but yeah. So, I'm going to go in with the um styler that I'm of choice. And let's go ahead and dip into the purple. Oops, I think I put too much. Hopefully, y'all can see this. It feels really slippery on the hands. 
like really slippery. Whoa. It feels nice on my hands, y'all. I don't feel like crazy or nothing like that. Kind of like a wax, but it's not as thick as a wax. Okay, y'all, so I'm all done with twisting my hair. As y'all can see, it is a little wet because obviously I use a twisting cream. Some of them are dry already. Um, they don't, they kind of feel firm, but not like super hard. But the color is really, really vibrant. And obviously, I can't just lay down like this, like with my hand on my pillow. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just put on my scarf. But this is how much of product I use. So a little bit of this goes a long way as y'all can see. Like I still have so much of it. So I'll be able to use this over and over again which is cool. And plus because my hair is short too. But I feel like even if your hair is longer than mine. It goes a long way. So this is my hair. So bright and pretty. I didn't um oil my scalp because I don't know. I just didn't want to put any oil on this. So I'm literally just going to put my scarf on like this. And I feel like y'all that it made my twists hold better. Like I didn't have to like twirl them that much around my fingers. Like I don't know because one of them is weird because the purple one. I mean the blue one says it has beeswax on the ingredients. But the purple one doesn't. But they both feel the same. So I'm assuming maybe they just missed the ingredient on that. Because this is the same exact, you know, wax, um, hair wax or whatever. So that's probably why it gave me good hold. Because of the beeswax. I mean, is that what it is? Yeah, beeswax. And then I am going to put my bonnet on top of this just to make sure. Because sometimes when I sleep, my scarf does come unraveled. And that would be tragic because then this stuff will probably be all over the bed. So I'm just going to put my bonnet on and I will see y'all tomorrow. What it do? Hey y'all. So I'm finally back to show y'all the results of my hair. Now I'm not even going to front. We're not even going to act like I'm not going to act like this is the next day because it ain't. This is actually two days later. <laughs> I know I did these twists two days ago. But I didn't take them out because I was doing other stuff. And y'all, yeah, I was just... Oh, I hope I ain't get no hair glue on my um sweater. But I was doing other stuff. So that's what took me so long. So let's just go ahead and take it off. Um, so yeah, my hair is super flat, y'all. Oh, look at it. All my twists are in place. So I'm gonna just take it out now. Probably wore the wrong sweater for this video, but uh, it's okay. Um, I would normally put some oil on my hair, but I'm not going to do that. Only because, like, I feel like it's going to take the color off. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so right off the back, what I'm noticing is I am getting a little bit of the residue on my finger. So, that lets me know that this will rub off. So, you can't be laying your head down on your bae. Don't be laying your head down on your bae. You're going to ruin your bae shirt now. This, <laughs> this is not for that, okay? Because you're going to have this everywhere. I had heard that um, people with longer hair that it did kind of shed onto their shirt. But y'all know my hair is short. So we're going to see. But it is on my hands. So I used the Pink Curling Twist Pudding. Which that product gives great definition. But I ain't even going to hold you up. The Glam Wax Temporary Hair Dye. This is giving great hold. Like do y'all see the hold on this? Okay y'all so... I took down all of my twists, as y'all can see. 
this is the aftermath of my hands so you will get something on your hands so i need to go wash my hands when i'm done and this is why i was saying don't be laying on nobody's shirt and if you have longer hair you might want to wear your hair up with this because it probably will get on your shirt because it is all on my hair it's not a whole lot on my hair it's my scarf but it is a lot on there but y'all the color is beautiful i went all the way outside to find the, my pick i'm out of breath and it was in here the whole time okay so i'm not gonna unravel my hair again i just took the twist out i'm just gonna lift them up with my pick <laughs> Y'all, it's all over my shirt. Oh my god. Why did I wear white? Why? 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 Oh my gosh. Why did I wear this? Like, I don't know. Trying to be cute. See, you can't be trying to be cute with this now. So with the temporary dye, the Glam West, what it claims to do, it claims to not hurt the hair, easy to wash. Um, this product is a one-time hair color, water suitable, non-greasy, natural matte finish, and natural scent with a distinctive three-dimensional hair layer. The lines are exceptionally dynamic, in shaping, strong shape, bring a shiny and unique personality. Claims to be shiny. Now, I definitely will say this is definitely shiny. Like, I mean, it's giving me luster. It's giving me looks. It's giving me color. It is giving me very, very vibrant color. And it definitely does give you hold. This twist out will probably last me a week with this product. The only con that I have about it is it does kind of flake off on you in little 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 micro pieces when i was hearing that it kind of does flake off people were right but i mean it's not bad it's not coming out in big chunks it's not bad i don't recommend wearing white like i did with it so i know you guys are wondering would i use it again yes i would totally use this again even when my hair gets longer i will use it again i'll just put my hair up in a puff but i will totally use it again this is definitely great for naturals that do not want to bleach out their hair y'all know i'll dye my hair but for those of you that do not want to dye your hair or damage out your natural hair or you're scared to you don't know what color will suit you well this is definitely for you like if you are leaning towards dyeing your hair and you want to know how the color is going to fit on your skin tone whatever the case may be although i feel like all colors look beautiful on melanin but you know what i mean um all hair types can use this product but I definitely feel like this is a really great creation. I really, really like it. Y'all would definitely be seeing me use this again because y'all know I love colored hair. If I had to rate this out of five stars, I'm going to give it, I will say I'm going to give it a four out of five only because, now it would be a five out of five if it didn't flake off. The reason why it came off on my shirt is because I was unraveling my twist. But I feel like throughout the day, it won't come off because I'm not going to have my hair, my hands in my head. But y'all, I like it. I think it's cute. Y'all have to let me know what y'all think. I think it is so cute. So I definitely will be using it again. And I'm going to take y'all outside. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Let me know if you tried the temporary hair color wax. Let me know in the comments below. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.